Hey, what's up, guys? You're watching Alin Rafa's Tech Channel in China. Hey, guys, welcome. We are here in Chongshan Park in Shanghai, and we are going to introduce you this robotic coffee machine. Okay, so this robotic coffee machine was developed by Shanghai High Dolphin Company. And let's try to get out a coffee. It's pretty simple. I have to press this button and I can select a lot of different coffees as you can see. This machine uh, offers over 50 different flavors. We have Asian flavors such as matcha, uh, soya milk, or we have the normal European flavors as well. Uh, cappuccino, Americano, coffee latte. Maybe try to get a matcha one. Let's try to go for a matcha latte one here for the Japanese selection. Let's go for the matcha. Here I can choose the sugar level. If I want to have a little bit sugar, medium sugar, or a lot of sugar, I want to have low sugar. I can also select um, if I want to have a hot one, a cold one, or one with ice. It's hot today, add ice. I add ice today for sure, but I don't want a sweet one. All right. So now it's pretty easy. I press here on the bay button. I want one cup and now I can pay very easy by my Alipay. I can scan the code and it's paid. Pretty good actually. Do you think this is gonna kill Starbucks? <laughs> Not sure about it, but the price is really good. I paid for this one now 12 RMB yeah, and this is like, really cheap. This like is $1.50. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. This is really cheap. Nice. So, really good. So, of course, what is a great advantage with this robotic coffee machine, you can use it for 24 hours a day, right? If that night, if you wanna have a coffee. And the cool thing is as well, the space. So you can save quite a lot of space, just 2.5 square meters. So you can place it everywhere, in an underground station, in a shopping mall, wherever it's you want. It's interesting for an airport as well. For an airport as well, yes, exactly. Or a train station or something. For sure. Um, of course, what is the idea behind this machine is to collect customer information, customer behavior, payment information, because with this technology, the company can automatically see when do customers actually buy a coffee, what payment method they use, when they pay or how often they drink a coffee and everything is automatized and it goes directly to the computer system and it's really good to collect all the customer data so i just got in a fancy coffee latte here iced virgin and um, the big difference to this machine to just a normal like you know like an automat is uh, that it basically the robotic arm really makes a difference so the coffee does taste different it tastes like uh, like it has been uh, prepared by a barista. So this is really a big difference to a normal uh, machine that you have like, you know, in an airport lounge or something different or something you have at home. So I think this robotic arm does make a difference. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Please, uh, if you like our content here from Shanghai and from China in general, please hit the subscribe button and give us a like if you like those kind of videos. And we are excited to hear about your comments and thoughts about these machines in the comment section. So if you think this is going to be the next Starbucks or it's going to be a serious competition, let us know. Take care. Bye-bye.